me show you a picture of the easy yoke and my, my daughter, Brianna, seven years old. There she is on the screen behind me. I'm looking over here, but you're looking over here. I called home uh, a number of years ago. She's a little girl. Brianna, I'm coming home for dinner. Great, Daddy, can't wait to see you. Just five minutes uh, from my office to home. This is before cell phones. It's dinner time, so I wanted Christy to, to know. And so I get, get home, open the door, and Brianna jumps off the couch, runs towards me, exclaiming, 433 seconds, 433 seconds, 433 seconds. And she comes into my arms for a big hug. She counted the seconds until daddy got home. Oh my gosh. She's 23 now. <laughs> She's not counting the seconds anymore. <laughs> but she's here at church with us and I'm thankful for that. And uh, what, what a wonderful daughter she is. And that story, I love that story. I think about that story because it teaches me about the attitude and the demeanor of a disciple of Jesus. Jesus said, if we want to enter the kingdom of God, we need to become like a child, you see? Even in this prayer, Jesus says, you've hidden, and his, he says, Father, you've hidden your ways from sophisticates and know-it-alls, but you've spelled them out clearly to ordinary people, even little children. See, we need to become like a child to see that smile on Jesus' face and to know that's God. God is looking at me with a smile, with grace, with love. He's happy to be with me. He delights in me, the prophet says. God even sings over you and over me with delight. He sings a love song. That's what Jesus shows us. Jesus shows us the smile of God. See, that's the easy yoke. <laughs> 